we are here. Maternity bras, maternity bras for the girls that have just had a baby or are nursing or going to nurse. Great, great items. Women love nursing bras. They're comfortable. Very hard to get in the larger size. It's not that easy. I have a number of maternity shops here in the state of Arizona that suggest customers come here because we have the sizes in stock. In stock here today, you walk out with your nursing bras. Not an easy task when you're a larger frame or a larger cupped mother. You come here, come here. MrBra.com will take care of you. I have a video on YouTube. I have 5 million, five million views on YouTube. I have a maternity bra tutorial. Maternity bra tutorial for you to look at. Which will give you information about the maternity bras. Okay, we had a larger size customer. She was referred. Referred by another a maternity shop. And she needed a bra. One of my favorite maternity bras is this style, which happens to be 100% cotton. I love cotton, especially when it's below zero, which it is today in the Midwest and Upper Northeast. Yes, sirree. Got to love that cold. Here you are. You have a cotton bra, maternity bra. You have three adjustments. Boom. Look at that. Three tasks. Three adjustments that you can use. As the breast gets larger, you can make it larger. Make the cup larger. There's three. I don't know if you can barely see it. There's three hook and eyes there. So you can adjust the size of the cup. Great bra, great bra. This happens to be an underwire. Some women want the underwires. They're more comfortable with the underwires. So we offer them an underwire. We have other women who like the non-underwire. Here's the non-underwire. Here's the non-underwire. Look at this. This is a smaller size. This is a 36 band. Look at this. Look at this wide back. This here happens to have four hook and eyes. Four hook and eyes. Which gives you great, great support. This is a 36F. Triple D F. Same holds true here. This is a non underwire. This is a non underwire. I prefer the non underwires when you the breast is going to fluctuate in size. So with that, you, you could have a problem with the wire, but some women assist on a wire. I like the non underwire better. Also, this is a cotton. I love cotton, more hygienic. I love white cotton, more hygienic. Uh, let me get to there you go. There's your hook again. There's your hook and eye with the opening for the breast for the baby to feed the baby. Hook it back up when the feeding is done. Not underwire. Not underwire maternity bra. That's what you just looked at. It's a cotton. I like cotton. I love cotton in maternity bras. It's more comfortable, more absorbent. I love white cotton. More comfortable, more absorbent, more hygienic. It's just better. I just like it's just a, more, a better garment, safer garment for the mother. I'm not big on treacle, but unfortunately. You know, that's what most of the bras are, even in maternity bras. So when you find a nice cotton bra in a maternity bra, 
You are one lucky mama. You are one lucky mama. We had a few regular customers come in today. Love those regular customers just come in. Uh, not familiar with their size. They've changed. Me, they've changed in their size. So they come in. We fit them, and they're familiar with my bras. So it's. A lot of times they just come in and they say, oh, I want this particular style, but I've changed my size. So that's what we do. Sometimes they have the bra on, so it makes it very easy. And also I have you on file. If you purchased from me in the past, I have you on file. We look you up, bingo. We see what you purchased in the past, and we either go with that size or a new size. Hopefully with the same bra. And we had a customer came in. She needed a 42J. 42J. God love her. What a doll. Came in. She needed two of them. Two black. 42J. Not underwire. Very well made bra. Very well made bra. Made her happy. Made everybody happy. Everybody's happy. Even everybody in Chicago. Even everybody in New York. Even everybody up in the East Coast. Even though it's below zero. Gotta love that weather. Love that weather. Next three days are going to be bitter, bitter cold. Bitter cold. Tomorrow, Sunday, playoffs. One of the playoff games, football, of course, is going to be in Green Bay. Green Bay, Wisconsin. It is going to be so cold up there. They're playing San Francisco. San Francisco has no idea about the cold that they're going to encounter in Lambeau Field. It's like, whoa. Whoa. Oh, my God. It's going to be so cold. A couple brides came in today, needed a strapless for their bridal dress. One had the dress. We fitted her. looked great. She was a uh, 44 double F. <clears throat> Instantly came in, measured her, bam, put the bra on. One bra first, bra fit her beautifully. Happy girl. Happy camper. My Bears aren't in the playoffs. They missed it. They lost. Just barely lost. Big mistake, but they lost. They lost to Green Bay. So, big rivalry. Not on the wire, 44 double, rather, this, this, the, the bridal bra was a 44 double F. She loved it. They love it when the bra fits good and it's strapless. You know, it's, it's amazing that they can be fit and fit well in that size. Another girl came in, another bride. She didn't have the dress. She was going to purchase the dresses, and for some reason, uh, a friend told her, that it's best to buy the bra when you and you have it on when you try the dresses, which is a good idea. It's still a good idea. Oh, I'd say about 40% of the brides buy the bra before, especially if it's a hard fit. And uh, this girl was a 46 double F. We took care of her. Lovely girl. Lovely girl. Easy squeezy. Came in, measured her. 46 double F which could be a G, slash G, and uh, she was tickled pink happy, you know, nice perky, they were nice, controlled, and uh, she looked good. Great bridal bra, love those bridal bra customers. She was sent from a bridal shop, 85% of my business is referrals, yes siree. I have a nice, I've showed you in other videos, a very nice, pretty, attractive, uh, seamless, and I carry it in the double D, triple D, and G cup. It has, it has a low plunge, comes in black and a nude, and a uh, young lady came in, and she was a 38 triple D. Not that easy to find. 38 triple D's, beautiful seamless plunge front. Great, kind of a formed or foamed, foam formed cup. Looked great on her. 
absolutely fantastic. Smile from ear to ear. She was a younger girl. She was maybe in her late 20s, early 30s. Happy, happy, happy. One of her friends had been here before <clears throat> and referred her to us. So we were very glad to take care of her, very glad she was happy, and hopefully she'll tell her friends, and the chain will continue. The dominoes will keep falling, and information will be flow as to Mr. Bra, the man with the bras. You need it, we have it. Hard to fit, no problem, we're here. Bride, no problem, we're here. Paternity. Having a baby, going to have a baby, come here. We have the bras for you. Woman called her mother, had been wearing an open bottom girdle for years, years. She probably had this girdle 10 years. <laughs> probably had the girdle 10 years, but hey, it worked. And you know what? It was a good girdle, and it lasted that long. That's why they searched me out. Why did they search me out? Because happened, I carry that line. I carry what she purchased. I carried what she wanted to purchase, that line. It had been around 90 years. Of course, it's a great line. They make good garments. Why do you come here? Why do you call me? I have the product. I have the best product. That's why you come here. Older girls are fun. They're 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 in their own little niche, in their own little world. She was in her 80s. Uh, you have to treat them a little differently, you know, with tender gloves. As I've told you in prior Ustream clips, everything you put on them, even if it fits right, it's too tight. It's too tight. <laughs> The girdle they had is 10 years old. The bra they had was 8 years old. It was all stretched out. They're used to loosey-goosey. And they think the new bra's got to be loosey-goosey. Well, when they bought the other bra, it wasn't. The bra that they were wearing was tight at one time. It's going to stretch. But in their mind, so you have to work with them gingerly. And explain to them, it's going to loosen. It's just in time, just like this bra, the one you came in with. Even her daughter started giggling. Ma, you've had the bra eight years. Ma, you had the girdle ten years. Well, this and well, that. It's kind of tight. Well, <laughs> I hate to tell you, but that's what a girdle is. It's tight. Why have a girdle if it's not tight? That's the whole purpose of a girdle. She also wanted a long line bra. Quite a few people... What is a long line bra? My God, what's a long line bra? She wanted a long line bra. I have a wonderful, I have about three, four, five wonderful long line bras. I have front closure long lines. I have back closure long lines. I have well made, super made, good quality front closure long line bras, back closure long line bras. This girl was, uh, she ended up purchasing a 46B. If she was 20 years younger, it would have been a 44B. But she had a hard time hooking it in the back, so she needed the 46B. That's what she needed. That's what we gave her. God love her. Bless her little heart. You know what? It's Saturday. The weekend's coming. It is the weekend. Uh, day's about over. Glad you were here. Glad to talk to you, especially about maternity bras. Any bra problem, you call me. Any bra problem, you text me. I will get a hold of you. I will talk to you. Bye for now. Have a great weekend. We will see you next time, next week. Bye for now.